Hi guys, today I'll be showing you how to make my version of lemon spaghetti. This is a blue apron meal, but I modified it to make it more filling and savory. For the ingredients you're going to need, a quarter cup of grated parmesan cheese, a third cup of panko breadcrumbs, a quarter teaspoon of crushed red pepper flakes, one shallot, two tablespoons of butter, one Meyer lemon, one tablespoon of turbinado sugar, a bunch of parsley, a half to a pound of spaghetti, three to four cloves of garlic, some strips of meat, I'm using turkey bacon, and then some mushrooms. The first thing we are going to do is uh, to get some zest from the lemon. You can use a zester or I'm just using a peeler and then I'm going to mince it. We'll cut the lemon into four pieces, deceive them, and then thinly slice them. Place all of the slices of lemon into a bowl, add the turbinado sugar, a pinch of salt, mix it, and then set aside to marinate. Go ahead and start cooking your pasta according to its instructions. Make sure to keep some of the pasta water. Next, you're going to thinly slice the shallot and two of the garlic cloves. You're also going to thinly slice the parsley leaves and stems. In a pan, heat two teaspoons of oil, add the two whole garlic cloves, and then cook for 30 seconds to a minute. Add your breadcrumbs, and then you're going to cook that into a golden brown and toast it. When finished, go ahead and take the garlic cloves out and discard them, and place all of the breadcrumbs into a bowl and set aside. Heat another two teaspoons of oil into the pan, add your marinated lemon, your shallots, your sliced garlic, and then go ahead and cook that. And then you're going to add your red pepper flakes. If it's too spicy, don't add too much. And then you're going to add your mushrooms, cook that, and then add a pinch of salt, black pepper, cook that again. And then add your turkey bacon or whatever meat you would like to use. Slowly add your cooked pasta into the pan and mix well. If the pasta seems a little dry, you can go ahead and add that water you saved from the pasta and mix well. Add the butter and the lemon zest. Go ahead and stir it. Make sure that the pasta is fully coated. You can go ahead and taste it and then season with salt and pepper. And then you're ready to plate. Start by putting that delicious pasta onto a plate. Add the toasted breadcrumbs some parmesan cheese and top it off with some parsley. There you have it. Enjoy!